I can't talk about mini pedals anymore. It's giving me a headache. Here, take two of these. Ah, flamma, little, yellow, different. What's going on, my friends? It's your old pal Sean Pierce Johnson here, and welcome back to Stomp Box Saturday. Today, we are going to be taking a look at probably the cheapest pedal I've ever demoed here on the channel in the form of the Flamma Innovation Drive pedal. Yep, little, yellow, and different. Or maybe we should add a question mark to that different. Why? Well, because Flamma says that this is a tube screamer sound pedal. But in my experience with this, this doesn't really feel or sound quite like a direct tube screamer copy. Housed inside a school bus yellow enclosure, we have a three knob overdrive pedal, which of course are usually the best kind of overdrive pedals. The little controls are volume and tone, and the big control is your overdrive control. We also have a two-way toggle switch. Wow, this format seems very familiar. Um, for hot and warm. So two different voicings of this overdrive pedal that Flamma says is a tube screamer sound. We have our power at the top of the enclosure, input, output, and that's all you really need to know. And oh, the other thing that you need to know is this thing is $30. People are going to see that price and immediately think that it's terrible. And they're also going to use the country of origin for this pedal as a knock against it too. But why don't we judge it on how it sounds? So let's go ahead and plug in. First, by checking out the range of controls on this pedal, the volume, the tone, and the overdrive. And we're also gonna flick this hot warm switch back and forth so that you can hear the difference between the two modes. <laughs>
90% of the time, I am going to have the Flamma Drive in the warm position. I just find that that works best for me. And in the months that I've had this pedal, I've kind of found a magical sweet spot for this pedal that works equally as well in front of my Hughes and Kettner and my Orange. Now, I want to show that setting to you with a Stratocaster and a Les Paul so that you can see that it basically works for both kinds of guitars, and I don't really have to do anything to change the tone. It just adds a little bit of grit and some harmonic nicety to the overall sound that just makes playing a lot more fun. And that's it, my friends. That is the drive pedal from Flamma Innovation. Flamma, I don't know what you did to make this as good as it sounds and be as inexpensive as it is, but whatever you did, it was a good thing. I really, really like this. I know they say it's a tube screamer sound pedal, but it just doesn't feel or sound like any tube screamer pedal that I've played. Sure, the gain range is very similar, and it's got that clean blend thing, but that clean blend is almost unnoticeable in certain settings, to the point where I'm convinced I'm playing with an amp-in-the-box style pedal. The tonal character that it imparts is just something that really speaks to me, especially with certain guitars like my Stratocaster, single-coil pickup kind of guitars, and even boosting the front end of the rocker verb with it for some really singing leads. It's just a lot of fun. And at $30, you can't afford to not try <laughs> this thing out. It's hard to argue with a drive pedal that sounds this good and can do so much for so 
little money. This was a big time surprise to me. I was really not expecting to like this pedal as much as I did. So bravo Flamma, thank you so much for sending it to me to check out and I hope you all enjoyed this look at it as well. And if you did, help me in a few different ways. Give this video a thumbs up, share a link to it with a guitar playing friend of yours, and of course clicking the subscribe button and ringing the notification bell. However, if you want to bypass that all entirely and really help a brother out, head over to seanpiercejohnson.com, scroll down to the bottom of the homepage, and sign up for my email list. That way, anytime a video goes up, you get the link delivered directly to your email inbox. And you're even going to get a little bit of extra insight into these pedals and products that I demo that I don't necessarily put into these videos. Might be worth a look. Anyway, thank you so much for spending part of your day with me. I hope you enjoyed it. And until next time, my friends, I'm Sean Pierce Johnson, wishing you all out there great tone, great health, and of course, happy stomping. Cheers, friends. God bless.